But he also messed it up. Like, why, why, why on earth did he play a high main in that spot? Like, just hero power. <laughs> it's just hero power there. Then it was a draw. Like, it, it just don't play the high main. Like, why would you play a high main? That doesn't make any sense. Like, the game is about to end, obviously. So, just pro tip, if you're playing against a mill deck, on the late turns, just try to force a draw. If it looks like, okay, this damage is not going to be enough, then just do the damage anyway, because the cold lights do also, like, damage the rogue player. So, like, force the draw. Draw might not be as good as win, but, like, it's better than guaranteed loss. Gold light plan, brand gold light would have been enough. Okay, it probably was. I didn't do the exact math. So I could have maybe done it. Uh, I'm not sure. I was just, you know. If, if I knew that I would, like, die to it, then I would have counted it more carefully. I was a little, that was a little bit sloppy counting, I guess. I guess I had quite a bit of overkill. Because I could have just, like, passed the turn. That's another card charm. Is the deck actually viable? Well, I've been doing okay with it, so. I don't know if it's, like, Tournament deck, probably not, but it's been okay to me so far. Let's not cycle the fan, just violet teachers and stuff. So, this is a good start for me. This is like the worst case for me, like getting so much stuff so early on. It's not even a good shadow strike. I want to do it something else. If I play this, he gets a pretty good swipe. I would like teacher wrath for two on this. How good is a shadow strike here? Because like Fundral or Teacher can't remove those anymore. Okay. Let's do this on curve. At least like Emperor absolutely sucks now. Emperor is like the worst thing ever now. Swipe, that's fine. It's not great, I'm not happy to see it, but it's gone now. So, I don't really think there's anything else. Okay, so if I shadow strike that last one, you could have like played the teacher already. So the teacher got one turn delayed, but it did cost me 6 health. He missed one damage? Oh, did he? So there's the pun, like this is what I was afraid of. It's exactly what I was afraid of. And the power of... Oh no, power of 12. Wow, so I need a, like a... Like an heavy straight and we good. It's not an heavy straight. I don't think it's gonna work, but we can try. It heals me for seven still. Okay, and um, well, if he brought, so I guess it doesn't heal. Damn it! I really need the shadow strike or heavy straight for Fundral in particular, like exactly for this card. It's just sad that I had used on the Drake. What if I sap the Drake? Uh, I don't know. It doesn't feel right either. Holy shit! Come on! This is crazy. Like, two broads and this. I still can't kill it. Like, what a disaster. Just have to play it and, like, maybe I get an Evis. Who knows? So I really need this to go off, but it's not that likely. And my life total is uncomfortably low. So even if it goes off, I'm like... dead to some swipes and stuff. But it's like, it's weird. The Shadow Strike and Evis Rates... If I keep those in the starting hand, they might not work out so well. Might get like too many. What? Smulching it? Okay. Why would you first play the Fondrel? That doesn't make any sense. So the mulch is gone, I guess we play this and zap that again. It's my last zap, but it's like, whatever. We just played a mulch. Oh, look, it's Fandral again. Yeah, time after time. Okay, this is an opening for me. Because uh, I can trade and ban. Oh, baby, we might be doing... Oh, my, it's even better. <gasps> Maybe I'll vanish this. Oh, my God. Yes. If 
Unfortunately, I don't have a prep. Let's do early the vanish because I played so many subs. Like the fan isn't bad. It's damage. I can even play this again, can I? It's gonna return. No, I can't. It's not gonna be three minutes. It's gonna be more than that. It's gonna be like five or four. Um. <laughs> Gang up giants. Okay, I guess we kill it. Fine. So I think we first wanna play this and gang it up before I go for the fan, so I have better chances to throw the throw one of the new gold lights. They could have maybe shadow steps this. No, oh, I probably should have. But I just got three new ones. It's like kinda okay to have it on the board potentially. Hmm. But I probably should have shadow stepped it anyway, because I might not draw a new cold light. Then I could like play this one and vanish maybe. Pay attention, class. But he played what? Oh swipe. Okay. I am fine with a swipe on this 2 too. Why did he do it like that? He wasted two damage. I think it's worth more to like just take the two and uh, I think that was a bad play from him. So I did pick up a new gold light. So keeping the gold light on the board in the end worked out very good. Let's hope I'm not dead at 10 health. I could be, but he played both of the living roots and both of the swipes. So it's extremely difficult for him to lethal me right now. So that was way better than I expected, keeping the gold light, I mean. Wasting a swipe. But even if he swipes there, I, I really think it was better to swipe face, hero power to cold light. It's two more damage to face. He takes two, but I take two more. It's worth it for him. Without a doubt. I don't know how this happened, but suddenly I'm the one with the board. Okay, draw cards. Honestly, like, as long as he doesn't deal damage to my face, it's not a, like a huge deal. If he draws cards, that's amazing. Minus eight. What? Oh, that's bad though. He might kill me. Oh, that's also pretty bad because, like, you know, it ruins the Reno and. Well, that's a disaster. It's actually super bad. Uh, yeah. And so I'm gonna be drawing those. So he has a paladin secret. I have to still do the. Oh my god, redemption. I have to still call light. Like, I know that I might draw into the wrong things, but. Maybe I should have done it with the Bran already, so I could like burn the rest of his deck. Is it too late now? Maybe I just admit my mistake. I, I, well, no, because I, now I avoid overthrow. I avoid overthrow, okay, so it was all planned. Yeah, yeah, it was better like this. <laughs> I don't know how, but we are like dodging all the... All the wrong things, like the, the, you know. So I need to avoid, like, uh... Well, I Maybe I keep this on the board. I don't... I shouldn't vanish. Don't think he has much direct damage. Like, Druid of the Claw. Raven Idol into something. Or, like, Druid of the Claw. That's not gonna do anything. Can you believe it? I actually have three ambushes in my deck. Which is the reason why we can't... ...use the thing yet. But it looks like it will not matter. Like, if this is his best play, if he puts zero damage to my face, then we're gonna win. So, I could avoid drawing here, just make some trades. Seems good. 
Uh, no, I have lethal, so let's do lethal. I can just play two cold flies. No, but no, 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 but there's, there's actually like in reality, there's only three cards in my deck because the ambushes are gonna like fast forward. So if I draw it, so I take like, too much damage, I need to draw six cards. Uh, can we draw six cards? I guess we can. Oh, but, but I, can, I can have a full hand. Then the ambushes don't happen, right? Do they happen? I don't actually need anything from here now. So now my hand is full, like, right? So the ambushes won't, like, do ambush things. So I'm gonna use the ambushes to my advantage. I could have also just the eviscerator, but this is, like, cooler. Wait, what? No, no, but it's like, it doesn't... Don't tell me to draw. Calculated. Maybe it's just the Abyss right now. Colento, what is going on? Please, Colento, you're not playing face someone, are you? Oh, it's Savis. He's probably playing some dumpster rogue. Let's keep the evolve. You're gonna be playing an evolve. So I've, I've been playing evolve, so if like Colento has like the same line of.